time now to bring out Artano, Woo! our very first special guest. Let's do it. Yeah, hey. Hey. Hello. 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 Favorite Artano cuties on the same screen. Yeah. All three yeah. It never happens. This is a first time. first time. One of one. One of one. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> so cool, man. So you guys have a lot going on. This uh, summer fest is in full swing. Yes. Mm -hmm. Yeah. It is. Yeah. It's and really just... going well. I mean, it's really, really great. I mean, for one of ones, uh, we've just been chatting in the back room and. We were talking about how one of ones are really picking off, even though the market is not that happy. But like the one of ones are really like people are really interested, in, which shows just how I guess it's like time for one of ones, you know, finally. So we're happy. Nice. It, and it kind of makes sense because it's like, OK, I I, I still want to I still am an art collector. I still want to get art. And it's the cheapest time you can buy one of ones for. So it's like mint and everything, right? Like it's so cheap to just get into the space right now. And yes, definitely. Good time. So I'd like to uh, pop up the uh, graphic here just so yes, everybody can get so a, a good idea of what we're talking about. The Cardano Summerfest going on on Artano. 15 plus talented artists, two months, auctions of one of ones. What can you tell us about this? What's the hype? Well, essentially the way that it started, we wanted to include more of the projects that are currently on Cardano to join Artano and to try the anti-snipe auction system. And that's where the whole thing started. And Tyler was there for the first conversations. And we were thinking like, how organized are we going to go with this? Like, are we going to invite just a few people and just give them the full freedom to like use the platform however they want? Mm -hmm. And then we're like, okay, so summer's coming up. Um, the best thing to do during the summer is to go to a festival. Um, so we were like, okay, let's make a Cardano Summerfest. And we invited a few curators, a, a few from the community, and then a few from the council members as well that are usually curating on Artano. And they were the ones who suggested some of the projects, the council members voted. And then I reached out to all of the ones that were selected asking if you would like to participate, if you have the time and, you know, it was a little bit short notice um and thank you the never engine for joining as well so yes. this is the never engine week for everyone who's not following yes. um so you should definitely go check them out um artano.io slash fest so it's essentially split into seven groups and each group has 10 days to do uh, whatever they want essentially you can you know auction as many nfts as you would like you have promo as well on our social media the promo materials that are made by our great designer edgar uh, we love you, Edgar, if you're watching. And yeah. if you're not, if you do one day, I'll forward you the video. <laughs> and yeah, so so we're just trying to have fun, right? And we're planning to organize Twitter spaces as well. The first week went with um, Yumi and Angel Baby Hit Squad. And so you can scroll a little bit down and then you can see the current auctions. Yeah. Oh, so yeah. Charles. That's Yumi. That's the baby Charles. And <laughs> now we have Ford Cotton, the first one. Um, and that's oh, what man, awesome. so cool. so, yeah. I didn't get to see it yet. It. Yeah, this yeah. is my oh, it's, awesome. it's incredible. Oh, it's already yeah, yeah, yeah. snatched. Okay. <laughs> I didn't know. Yeah, it has two days. They have a lot of artists. So basically, all their artists are from El Salvador. And I've seen the list. It's eight artists so far. They kind of teased what the artwork is going to be like, but they didn't mint all of them. I think they want to keep the surprise factor alive. Uh, but yeah, I mean, it's looking amazing. And I'm so happy because there's such a variety of artists on the platform. Uh, yeah. And now we're putting projects into it as well. I am super excited and very happy for this one. It is all over the board. Like, I, I don't think I've ever seen such a lineup that is just like covering a lot of different ground. It's really awesome. And just going, just looking at Artano these days, it's very hard for me. I'm just like, I want that. I want that. I want that. Yeah. I want that. Like, so I'm like, I need to like yeah. put away my passwords and like oh, yeah. all the keys, just give them to someone and, like change this. Because we need a custodian. Yeah, no. <laughs> totally. I know. I can't even imagine what it's like for y'all. We just bought something today because yeah. we felt like it was we made our first sign. buy on our tunnel today. And uh, it was funny because I almost stole it from you guys without even knowing. <laughs> I put in a bit. It was, it was too late, but we got it. But uh, this is this is the one. Uh, this is really yes. nice. Oh, small play. Yeah. Uh, Those are incredible. Shout out to Asbeam. He's Asbeam. he's yeah. amazing. Like the work yeah. that he does is just incredible. Like. Yeah. 
the the style the the level of detail oh my god i'm he, like i want to move in there in yeah. these small places he, he deserves so much more attention i think from the space like yeah. this is the 11th piece like it's been going on every monday so uh, actually today's thursday so i don't know i think it's monday to thursday um and yeah it's it's really incredible work and it's su it starts super low like five eta to ten eta mm -hmm. uh, and he has like these bigger places like it's a small like, this is a small place he has little places they're a bit bigger <laughs> <laughs> and they're like, bigger pieces actually it's not like a square so it's interesting it's and then they, cool. they go for a bit higher but this is super you know yeah it's kind of it's super cute and it's a we great miss the swamp too we miss the swamp of new orleans sometimes so now we'll just have it in our wallet yeah yeah well, <laughs> it was yeah. you know the the bid was like 45 ada or 40 or something and i was like how can i not no i think it was 35. Mm -hmm. it is crazy right. it's seriously undervalued it's i went one time and i was like i feel guilty buying this because someone from the community could get it like, <laughs> for 65 and it's insane like yeah. yeah quality is just wild so i'm happy that i got one for myself yeah and i'm just gonna give the rest to the people that notice so i'm not gonna snipe anymore Nice. You're good. You're good. A little message here <laughs> from chat. Uh, Eero Art says, thank you, Artano, for the Uni uh, oh, Universe 25 oh, It's such a great experience. No, thank you to the Universe team. They were so awesome. They brought the idea yeah. to us. Essentially, like all the things go to the Universe 25 team because they put in so much wow. effort into organizing this, minting everything, and yeah. then, you know, including like the distribution and to the artists and organizing the auction because it was a lot of nfts as well like at the same time and they managed it all perfectly um so i'm super happy that they brought it to artana and if there's any other project that wants to do something similar I'm more than happy to help and, yeah. and onboard them as well so yeah it was an incredible experience so yeah that's very yeah. nice to have someone you know really working with you that way for sure it is so cool to see all the different styles too like I don't think we've seen anything like that since like collab bits like way back in the day. Yeah, like, a bunch of different yeah. artists just work. Yeah. Oh, nice. Yeah, I love that tree one so much. The yeah, that was yeah, crazy. That's beautiful. Yeah. And that robot one, and that uh, like <laughs> abstract one. Yeah, <laughs> it took totally. me a second to figure. You that totally one. see it. You got after, so many yeah, ideas too. yeah. Yes. Oh, that one escaping reality was my favorite, and I've seen it after it sold. And I was so sad. The one at the bottom. Oh, oh that's so good. Oh my God. It, the color, like everything about this, is just speaking wow. to me, and yeah. I missed it. And I'm so look at the price. All <laughs> <Yeah>. right. <laughs> that's crazy. So that's oh what you God. need. Everybody, get down to Artano while the deals are hot. <laughs> Honestly, <laughs> I mean, that's true. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. That's true. <laughs> It's not shilling if Summer says it. So. <laughs> <You're safe. laughs> That's right. <laughs> Ladies' choice. <laughs> so how has uh, how you know you guys obviously had a vision for this uh, this sale? Has that vision? Do you feel it's being executed? Do you feel like the things festival. are going the way you want it to be? Yeah, for the festival. For yeah, a hundred percent. Yeah. Oh yes. 100%. The people are the projects are so engaged. Yeah. And they really want to make this a big deal and use it to like bring up their artists as well, which is incredible. I mean, it's really the freedom of like doing anything you want and we're just here to help you out and you can carry it out however you want. Um, and yeah, we include pretty much the promo across all our channels for us. It's all about bringing the community together and getting the collectors to kind of like look at something else that they might not see otherwise because Cardano is getting so big now. Yesterday, I think it was like 24 our volume was something like million dollars, right? So that's a lot of NFTs traded. Um, so in any case, it's very difficult nowadays to get eyes of collectors on any given piece or collection. So this is really a, like a great opportunity for some big, really big projects to bring eyes to other projects as well. And the collectors to mingle. I I mean, honestly, so far going great. The summer is yeah. heating up pretty so well. Started. This week is crazy. <laughs> so it is. It's gonna be awesome. Yeah. I mean, I can't think of anything I want more than like freedom to do what I want and have support at the same time. Like, like with art, like that's like every yeah. I I, I can see why everyone would be excited about it. We just like totally need to have more stuff like that. And it's really uh, been a great opportunity for us because you finally gave us a reason in that to to buckle down and do, and do this one thing we've been wanting to do so bad for like <laughs> almost a year now. Uh huh. Yeah. Awesome. Awesome. I'm happy to hear that. And, awesome. uh, actually, I have a little preview I'd like to share of Ooh, this, uh, of this yes. piece. Never Too before seen it finished 15 minutes before the show started. Um, <laughs> so we're we're continuing to this, work yes. um, 
on this thing. We were set back by COVID. I got COVID and I just couldn't do anything for like a week and a half. But uh, we're we're closing and we in on be finishing in the same this thing. Room. <laughs> yeah. yeah. All right, so let me show you this thing. So this is called... We know how to go hard when we need to. That's right. This one will be called Dam After Dark. Dam After Dark. And this is just a little preview. Not the final yeah. thing, but here we go. Oh, wait. Oops. I'm doing it. I have to click this button. Okay. Oh. So you should be able to hear the music as well. Oh, yeah, nice. Oh, wow. wow. I love it. I love it. I didn't see that. Okay. Yeah, I've, I mean, I've seen some snippets of it. I feel like I've seen the preview, the backdrop somewhere, awesome. but not the change. This is awesome. This is great. Yeah. The variety is also <laughs> huge. I mean, That's in amazing. a sense of like of all the different projects that we have onboarded, some of these NFTs and the styles, like Tyler said, they're so different, but they're all incredible in their own way. Like, I love it. Totally. Wow, even the shadows are accurate. That's why. <laughs> yeah. yeah. That's my favorite part. Because the, the piece had such strong shadows. It that was does. part of what drew me. Yeah. Oh, my God. <laughs> Amazing. So this is a small fraction of what will be. There are about 70 people in this picture. So wow. a lot of dancing. It's a full-on raid. A lot of costumes. <laughs> and uh, we're going to have a few different versions of it. Uh, actually, let me show you this other one, too, since we're talking about Artano and all that. Uh here we go. More teasers. Yeah, another little teaser. Why not? So this is uh, wow. oh, the. There's going to be three versions. There's one that's kind of hellish, and one that's a rave, and one that's more spacey. And we're going to be dropping three different uh, one of ones as part of this. And it's basically like three different timelines of the same, same kind of universe, and. So in one of them, they're damned after dark, like the devil is coming. In one of them, uh, you know, you know, dimensions are colliding. And in the other one, they're just sick of all that, you know, straight laced prudence, prudent life. And they're trying to get wild. <laughs> <laughs> all at the same time. I love it. Yeah. yeah. So the original picture was, it's titled uh, The Dam and Damrak, which is. Uh, it was a piece from like the 1600s and so we took the dam but we went after dark with it and we see what people are up to because in my mind everybody like how many people back then would have gone to a rave if they could have what like look at the picture there's 70 on. people in that picture what percentage of those are ravers in our timeline you know with nowadays? a mask on they'd go so yeah. i think it's we need to let these old painting because it's not just a bunch of people doing old timey stuff these are real people living in the modern time yeah at that the point mo the, that was the most modern, modern time. time that there ever was when it was happening and i think it's important to remember that mm -hmm. yeah it's true it's true i love yeah. fun with that uh summer awesome. fest. you can go so far i mean yeah. i'm going to Excited. be here to support you pretty much however i can because it's usually me like on Twitter texting projects yeah. and Matteo, of course. So any one of us, if you need anything during the time or like if any of the projects actually needs to kind of like transition into a different group, that's also flexible. This is why we didn't announce everything at once. Yeah. So we left the announcements for like a few days before because you never know what can happen. So yeah. everything is kind of like in the air right now, confirmed, but just leaving flexibility for people to like move around a bit yeah totally yeah, we're gonna That's have ours decision. up uh next week we'll be ready to uh to start these That's auctions exciting. yeah <laughs> it's coming cool. i was pretty excited to be up there with fort gotten too i was like yeah nice. <laughs> it's a nice fire line of, like it's a fire all line, the yeah. matches are it turned out so great it's like faith and universe just put it yeah. together yeah it's we've amazing. had chatted with fort gotten quite a bit and, mm -hmm. and showed off some of our pieces and yeah we're, we're really into it yeah yeah, Amazing. so fun, man. What a cool thing. Artano, you know, it began it, when it first started. That was one of the first things we ever me, saw. Well, you know, we came from Ethereum, right? And at that point, like, foundation was yeah. the the hotness. Mm -hmm. But I don't know. It's like, when Artano came out, I was like, could this be, like, the Cardano the foundation, you know, <laughs> yeah, in yeah. a way? Yeah. And yeah. so far, so good, guys. It really is. I mean, thank you. Thank you so much. I, I like this even better. There's color in heart. this one, right? There's, there's, heart. There's, there's heart, exactly. And that's there's a bit of attitude. Our designer is a very opinionated person, and you can see it in the design of like the entire marketplace and like all the materials. So it's, it's yeah. 
all credits is, in yeah. terms of like the look and the vibe and the feel and the, the entire experience that's all edgar so yeah that's what you want because opinions are often like you know passion and and you know it, it's not going to come across as like neutral or just corporate if somebody has true love yeah, and, yeah a lot of these marketplaces just look the same everything's like just like too polished or like you know like a hospital sort of like you're just like yeah. oh, <laughs> yeah. Yeah. screen nothing nothing's going on and for us we're, we're just like we want happiness like to jump at you when you go to the page and we hope we hope that happens i guess when you it totally um, does yeah. and the, especially the cardano summer fest like i yeah. love that yeah me too we wanted a festival vibe and we're like edgar feel free to go crazy because yeah. he loves to design like posters for parties and we're like okay but we need like <sighs> all the materials for it right like a website and just to have a real vibe right because for a festival it's not enough to you should make everything branded so mm -hmm. he really like did his best work and this was the first iteration and we were like this is incredible we love it let's go with it yeah and, it does uh, look like a party cool. poster like a yeah i see that now <laughs> Yeah, he's into raves as well. He's a the, the high quality kind of person. <laughs> Very nice. So uh, Summerfest is going on uh, for a couple months, but then, yes. you know, then what? What's coming next? What's on the horizon for y'all? So, so I think right now I just want to mention like two pieces that are on there. Uh, one is with Akamai, and this is like an ongoing auction. It's a really incredible piece. It's like trillions of bytes of data, and it's like a live stream of the internet, basically. So you can own the internet uh and you know kind of own a piece of like internet history one year of it and this is gonna this is just a preview of the piece it's not the final one and basically we're gonna start for one year it's gonna be all the data like hacks i don't know bad good things gaming uh, social media stuff so everything's gonna be uh, explained and interpreted by the artist luc dubois and akamai is you know working with us. they're a huge company you know a huge like they've built the internet so it's really an honor to have their piece on our platform and this nft is like something that's kind of going under the radar right now we're trying to kind of now pop it to the surface and uh, you know it's it's a long auction it's 30 days so you know we have time but it's something we want to kind of bring the attention to for the community because this is really a huge piece and you know we're talking to top museums around the world to display this hopefully one of them picks it up wow. um, so like really like big names and yeah, hopefully it gets there. Uh, and it's a really interesting, it's like a really complex NFT actually. I mean, I think it's one of the kind of technically most complex NFTs maybe ever to be made because it's a live stream of data. There's a lot of like internet stuff going on and you have to kind of filter that. And then you have to create this live stream that's visualized and you have to explain what each of these lines means and so on. So you have to kind of understand the piece. So it's both artistically and technically complex. And yeah. it's, yeah, it's a, I think it's really incredible work from, from all these, amazing people genius people who've done it so I put it together so yeah and it's uh, that's like really kind of high high end art on our tunnel and we're happy to to have that there as well i feel like i'm watching the inside of someone's brain which you kind of am uh -huh. computer's ro yeah. robot's brain everyone's <laughs> brain everyone's everyone's activity yeah, yeah. yeah. Dan, that's really awesome though and it does seem like it would take a lot of technical time to yeah, it's being developed right now as we speak, right? So it's it's really a live piece of making yeah. being made in, in, in many uh, ways. Cool. Yeah. Yeah. That's crazy. Yeah, well, that's one of them. And so for the future, I mean, maybe we can mention as well uh, Jason's piece just quickly. And if you want to do that. Or sure, yes. Is so that something we can pull well, up? Or? Yeah, maybe you can go on the homepage. And I think the first or the second piece should be actually Jason's piece. There you go. Oh, yes. yeah, yeah, I was reading about this. Yes, yeah. yes, right, it's yeah. an incredible piece. We were today in uh, Twitter spaces at Cardano over coffee, and Jason was explaining like what the piece is actually about. Uh, and essentially, it's a statement about collecting art on Cardano and making space for the high quality art uh, on Cardano as well. So bringing a lot more attention to one of one pieces and appreciating not only projects, but appreciating artists and their work. And, you know, it's kind of a, it was a really, really long talk that we, that we had with Jason around this piece and like how it came about, but he wanted to bring more attention to the type of, to the level of value that artists on Cardano deserve. Um, and especially when it comes to like high quality art that needs to be appreciated, this is the kind of, you know, area where we are missing a lot in the Cardano space, I would say. 
because if you look at the price tag, it's like 30,000 ADA. And how many one of one artists can you think that have that price out anywhere right now? Because I can't think of any one of one artist that's not project associated that has that price, right? No. So it's just a lot more of a serious conversation um, that needs to be had on Cardano. And that's what he's trying to achieve with this piece. So essentially, the auction lasts for like, you can see five days and 11 hours. And this is the piece that when, once the person buys this piece, they're getting another sort of a say, complimentary piece from Jason. I know what it is, but I can't talk about it. I don't know. I don't know what it is yet. It's going to be an know. NFT that changes over time. So it's going to be an INFT, uh, but he's yeah. not disclosing cool. anything yet. Essentially, the piece will be made only if this one is sold. So if there's bids on this and there's a buyer, that will come to life. If no, then probably no one's going to hear about it. Yeah, and it is, it's, it's an incredibly important, it's a very, very big statement piece. And I think it's the biggest statement piece that we've seen to date. Like it's a very serious conversations that we need to have. Like, can one of one artists uh, have a, a future on Cardano? Yeah. And I think it's a pretty big it's question. It's a serious right? question, yeah. Definitely. Very serious question. Um, and it calls, like I could go on for this for hours. So just like interrupt <laughs> me, please someone. You like it. <laughs> I love these conversations because that's kind of the atmosphere and the vibe that we're also trying to bring to Cardano as well. Of, of course, we love projects and, you know, everyone loves seeing them getting appreciation. But at the end of the day, also do the artists behind those projects also deserve appreciation for work outside of the project. And we want to make sure that Cardano gets that number one spot that we're all chasing, right? To get the recognition, I think we need to be a little bit more uh, serious in that sense in the price ranges as well. and this is a great way for collectors to take notice because I think the piece certainly has this value and above it probably. Um, and it's just a matter of getting the collectors to see it. So this was a perfect chance. Thank you so much for the invite because there's still five days left. Yeah, good, 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 good. Um, so we're in time and I'm super happy to support Jason whenever I can. So yeah, and Artana as well, the entire team, of course, not just me personally, but it's it's an awesome piece. So that's what's going on right now. Cardano Summerfest, Aquai Technologies, Jason Matias, uh, go check them out on all their socials. And um, future, yeah, is, so, bright. So the future is bright. Future looks bright. We're very energized. Like the markets are tanking, and we're just like we're just like yeah. working. <laughs> no, no, sure. no, it makes me very happy. I've never been this like energetic ever, ever. Um, so it's it's my peak of like satisfaction with where we are yeah. currently. Because NFTs don't seem to be slowing down. Like I barely no. Yeah. Yeah. Right now. Yeah. But you that, know. But it's a million dollars, so that means two million ADA is you know traded. So that's very true. Yeah. Not bad. Yeah. And you and you guys seeing that <coughs> and keep keeping have, exuding positivity just helps everybody else too. Thank you. Same same oh. for you guys. Really. Absolutely. Only <laughs> good vibes. Yeah. Only good vibes on the show. Yeah. Awesome. Um, for the future, um, so one of the things that we're working on is currently the new UI that's coming up next week. Ooh, oh, it's going to be a lot more polished. Like right now, yeah. it's a bit uncategorized, um, and then, so to speak, right? It's going to have an auction section. Um, there's going to be another discoverable section, and yeah, we're working as well on the sold section so that people can see like what was sold. Like a lot of these small updates that really make a big difference, yeah. um, mm -hmm. and a new banner sort of look yeah. to it. Yeah. Uh, but you'll get to see it next week. And then that's going to be really fun to see what was sold. Yes, yes, absolutely. Because yeah. we know, like everything in the in the back end, like we, we keep constantly getting alerts for these things, but a lot of people don't like actually yeah. see what got sold. So that's a good point. Yeah. I, like, see that. I know yeah. the hardest. Like he sold so many. Oh, right? yeah. I feel like I've only seen like. Oh yeah, Zachary is oh, yeah. incredible, incredible. Yeah. Whatever he means, he sells. Yeah. Like, yeah, that's the rule. That's <laughs> it's kind of like how it works with him. Uh, but he's incredible. He's an incredible human being. Like he's yeah. very good at also like communicating his art. So it's no wonder to me um yeah. what else aside from the new ui we're also working on um catalyst i mean we got catalyst yes. funding last week oh, so yeah. that's really great uh, and we're building this nft minting solution so everybody can use minting nfts like that change over time and yeah that's, that's cool. really great because like we've I've all been, we've all been salivating over them since we saw y'all i know i know we just want to scale that yeah and it'll take like maybe until end of, i mean i hope until end of august i don't know if it's going to be like longer than that but that's kind of our goal 
So well, we're working on some conceptions nice. for some INFTs. Yeah. We'll be testing out your system. Yes, please do. It's, it's really going to be awesome. It's going to yeah. be so much Can fun. We... <laughs> um, and yeah, yeah, I think, I mean, there's a bunch of like small things that are going on. Yeah. One thing we want to enable for the collectors is to buy without having to create an account. Um, because that's like from the very beginning, we did it for legal reasons, mainly that everyone has to create an account. But mm -hmm. obviously, like in the future, that's one of the things that we want to focus on, enable as many people to engage and interact with the art on Atana without actually having to give their email or anything like mm -hmm. that. Um, so that's Isn't a priority as well. Yeah, yeah, for sure. Yeah, that sounds really cool. Good uh, stuff. I'm so glad that y'all are uh, have the intention of just being good at what you do and wanting to bring forth like better quality of art because yeah i mean we're just not going to get as many different kinds of people that we need if we don't have that happening and it's a I good time reason. for things to change right now yeah definitely yeah yeah and if any people have any suggestions on like features yeah. that we should implement anyone watching or anyone like tyler obviously tyler we talk to you like every day um <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> so you have like a direct line um hot <laughs> in summer Feel free to give any suggestions as well. Anything you think is useful from like an artist or, or yeah. collector perspective. Um, that's also useful feedback for us because we have a lot of like internal discussions on what should be done, but this type of yeah. like user feedback is also super valuable. So just shoot us a message, uh, tweet, DM, pretty much, um, yeah, anything would work. All the places. <laughs> All right. well, this, uh, that's really cool. I mean, just seeing what you guys are doing and uh, we know that whatever's next is going to be as exciting as it can be. You guys are very good at, yeah. at putting it together in, in a very nice package. So we're looking Thank forward you. to your generation. And it just makes me so happy that like, you know, that when I first saw Artano and I thought it looked so great that the people behind it are even greater than I thought that they would be. Oh, you know? Thank you so much. That really means I, a lot. I feel like my intuition is right, you know? <laughs> like, <laughs> Thank you so much. Definitely. Yeah. All right. Well, this has been a lovely time. I'm sure we'll uh, enjoy your company once again in the future. Party at the I'm sure. Of course. <laughs> soon, soon. Pretty soon, hopefully, yeah.